Hi guys, welcome to WST channel. Today, WST takes you to understand the crucial differences between anodizing and electrophoresis. Electrophoresis has one more painting process than anodizing. Put the anodizing alumina into an electrophoresis paint tank. It will form a dense film that is electrophoresis. These profiles are electrophoresis. These are anodizing profiles. Let us compare the two surface treatments. First, application differences. Electrophoresis is mainly used for coating and ending corrosion. The material can be metal or non-metal. Industries like automobiles, furniture, and electronics use electrophoresis. Anodizing is mainly suitable for anti-corrosion and beauty of aluminum materials, such as construction, aerospace, marine, and other industries. Second, finish effect differences. Electrophoresis finish is even and smooth. The protection is perfect. Anodizing finish can increase the corrosion resistance. Then, service life differences. Anodizing service life is shorter than electrophoresis. Last, prices differences. Anodizing price is lower than electrophoresis. In summary, if you have enough budget, electrophoresis is your best choice. Want to get more suggestions? Contact Westing now. We will help you make the best decision.